So I could not be more pleased and more honored to introduce to you the people's champion, the Tribune of the 99%, Senator Elizabeth Warren. In every fight to build opportunity in this country, in every fight to level the playing field, in every fight for working families, the path has been steep. Throughout our history, powerful interests have tried to capture Washington and rig the system in their favor. From tax policy to retirement security, the voices of hardworking people get drowned out by powerful industries and well-financed front groups. Those with the power to fight make sure that every rule tilts in their favor and everyone else just gets left behind. We all do better when we work together and invest in the future. We know that the economy grows when hardworking families have the opportunity to improve their lives. We know that the country gets stronger when we invest in helping people succeed. We know that lives improve when we care for our neighbors and help build a future, not just for some of our kids, but for all of our kids. These are progressive values. These are America's values. When conservatives talk about opportunity, they mean opportunities for the rich to get richer and for the powerful to get more powerful. They don't mean opportunities for a young person facing $100,000 in student loan debt to start a life, for someone out of work to get back on his feet, or for someone who worked hard all her life to retire with dignity. The game is rigged. The rich and the powerful have lobbyists. Lobbyists and lawyers and plenty of friends in Congress. Everyone else, not so much. Now we can whine about it, we can whimper about it, or we can fight back. Me, I've decided I'm fighting back. <laughs> this is how I see it. We, we the people, decide the future of this country. These are our shared values, and these are the values we are willing to fight for. This is our moment in history. We are called on to determine the future of this country. And if we stand by and let it slide away, then shame on us. But if we get up and we fight for what we believe in, we will head this country in the right direction for ourselves, for our children, and for our grandchildren. I hope you're ready to fight. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Elizabeth Warren. Tribune of the 99%.